Hi everybody and welcome to part one of the Let's Play The Sims 3 Supernatural and we are missing somebody in our f household. Wait a second. Wait a second. What the heck? Hmm. Is she invisible? I don't know, but we're going to have to see. So we are starting out a new Let's Play. The supernatural let's play i guess you that's what you can call it or whatever but um hopefully my mic sounds a little bit better um because i did have sparkly simmer help me with it and everything like that so hopefully it sounds a lot better because it was getting really annoying so we're gonna go ahead and just buy this furnished and hopefully our third person is actually there it doesn't look like it she's there but we'll have to see that's weird so I don't know so once this loads up I will introduce you guys to the characters okay good she is there that's just 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 weird I don't know what's going on don't know what's going on so yes hopefully my mic sounds better because it was so annoying trying to get it figured out like so annoying we turned down my volume a little bit Okay, so everyone should know Faye Rosemary. She is the um, fairy that I created with Sim Links. <laughs> totally forgot what I was saying. So I'm going to be using her for this Let's Play, but she is a supernatural fan, loves the outdoors, vegetarian, good, and green thumb. Favorite color is lime. Her favorite food is veggie burger, and pop is her favorite music, and she wants to be or lifetime wish is a magic makeover and then she's our fairy and this is our witch her name is elena clay she's brooding daredevil natural quick evil and mean-spirited her favorite color is white because she's gonna be just dull um her favorite food is egg rolls and her favorite music is pop as well and her lifetime wish is the zombie master which is turn 10 different sims into zombie using the Reanimation ritual or potent zombification elixir and if you guys heard that sorry about that and this is Mal malcolm waters and he is our werewolf he is also a supernatural found a couch potato night owl commitment issue has commitment issues and a dog person um his favorite color is spice brown his favorite food is macaroni and cheese and his favorite music is indie and he wants to be the leader of the pack which is convert five sims to werewolves and find 40,000 simoleons worth of objects while hunting with the pack. So, let's just go ahead and get started. And I have a really bad headache right now, and I don't know why, but I'm sorry if you guys can hear Daniel walking. But I'm going to sell that because that would just get annoying because it's right in front of the house. And we're also going to go ahead and sell this bed. And we're going to just turn this into the girl's bedroom so that um, we can, we'll can we have them share a bedroom. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm not going to get them bunk beds because they're too old for bunk beds. Even though they're too old to even be sharing a bedroom, but they're too old for bunk beds. So let's just go ahead and get the one from Supernatural. And I want to get the light colored one because I think it's I think it's gorgeous. It's pretty expensive, but it's definitely worth the money because again, it is just it's gorgeous. And I actually want to move this door over so that we can put this one right over here. Um so let me go ahead and do this really fast. Ah, I lost it. There we go. And that way we can put the little night tables or end tables right there as well and we'll probably use one from supernatural as well um if i can find one um here we go here we go there we go all right and then this one all right there we go and then let's go ahead and my mouse just went crazy. Let's get them a light or two for the side tables. So let's go ahead and give them these ones. This 
all of these match, which is awesome. So everything matches and it's just awesome. All right, and as for the boys' bedroom, it's perfectly fine. Who cares? And let's go ahead and get another chair because two chairs for three people is just not going to work whatsoever. And other than that, I think that's good. I do want to go ahead and get a few things that ham, him, him, came with Supernatural. Um, there is this beehive right here. I want to get this beehive so that we can harvest some beehive or bees and everything. And then there's also this alchemy station, which I want to get alchemy station because we're going to have one of our sims be like have the alchemy or whatever i don't know and then let's go ahead and get the fairy bungalow for Faye. and that was expensive holy cow didn't realize how expensive that was and there's also this moon lamp um um the only bad thing about the moon lamp is that the fairies are very attracted to it and so once you light it, you guys gotta be careful because your fairy, I think, can die. I don't know though, but this mood, the Spectrum Mood Lamp. Understand this is not some gimmicky lamp that will try to protect your mood. No, no, no. This is a magical lamp that causes people's moods to shift in certain ways. A full spectrum of colors, a full spectrum of possibilities. Let the mood strike you with the Spectrum Mood Lamp. So we're gonna go ahead and... I don't know if we put it in the middle of the table if they can actually use the table still. We'll have to test it out, most likely. But we're gonna, that's all we're going to get. And I'm going to say bye to Daniel because he has to go to work. So I'll be right back. All right, sorry about that. Of course, when I start recording, he'll say something. Well, it looks like Faye and Malcolm does not get along. Faye actually just did a fairy trick on him without me telling him. Um, he did, they did like the teeth chattering one, so I'm like, I'm sitting here and I'm saying bye to Daniel and it was still playing and I'm like, oh no, she didn't. Oh no. Okay. So let's go ahead and set the bed ownership or they're just going to go to whatever bed they want. So I'm just going to set them. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and have Malcolm, um, and another reason why I'm not having like a vampire or a ghost or anything like that is because a vampire came and was introduced in from uh, late night. So I don't think I really need to cover that. But I'm going to go ahead and have him. He wants to join the education career. So I guess I could have him join the education career just because it's a wish of his. And I don't really have any set like... Um, careers that I want them to go into. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and um, join the education career. And I have a really bad... She wants to join the criminal career. So she can join the criminal career because I'm never in the criminal career ever. Ever, ever, ever. So, oh my god, my head hurts so bad. And I need to go to bed. I woke up late today. I don't know why. Where's the criminal career? Where's the criminal career? There it is. Criminal hideout. Join the criminal career. And what does she want to do? Um, she wants to join the firefighter career. I'm sorry, but you're not going to be a firefighter. You're like, no. You're going to be our alchemist. How about that? You can be our alchemist because you're already right next to it. So, might as well. So, you can be our alchemist and... They can work, and you can grow a garden, and you can just have a bunch of fun while they're working their butts off being able to pay your rent. I think that sounds good. Okay, so he wants to transform into a werewolf and harvest nice money, or f money, honey. And he also wants to go search for fairies at the auditorium. So before he gets goes home, let's actually go to the auditorium, and my foot is falling asleep. Wherever the auditorium is, um, orbitorium, or I don't even know how to pronounce it. It's the thing where the fairies hang out at. Um, there it is, right there. 
um, search for fairies. There we go. He can go ahead and search for fairies because he's already out and about, so might as well. And she wants to roll in university. Uh, no, we've already bought an alchemist table. Okay, so you can go ahead and come home. And I had a yawn. So yeah, hopefully my mic sounds better. Um, I looked at the recording and it does sound a lot better. So hopefully everything just is better all around. So let's go ahead and smoke the box, feed the box, or bees, clean the box, smoke the box, feed the bees, and clean the box. What a tongue twister. And is that what I think it is? Is that a rat? That is a rat. What are you doing on our lawn, you rat? Huh? Okay. So, you stupid mascot. Can I just delete you? Delete. Delete. I don't have any of the, uh she's on anymore so okay so is he searching for fairies yes ah no you stupid god it's so annoying i don't like university to tell you the truth i don't what was that isn't this a gorgeous this is like so gorgeous okay the hunt begins malcolm water approaches the magnific magnificent G, I can't even read tree. Its branches hold a seemingly impossible bounty of pink and white flowers. This seems a likely place to attract fairies. Malcolm Waters would have to do some climbing to search among the branches. At the time, at the same time, there is a large hollow beneath one of the tree's roots that seems to lead into an underground tunnel. It would make a great hiding place, but there's no telling what it leads. What will Malcolm Waters do? Climb into the branches or search the tunnel? Let's go ahead and climb into the branches. What could possibly go wrong? Haha, oh, that is so cool. Okay, it's been a rough start, but Malcolm Waters knows he's getting closer. Following the sound of trickling water, um, he quickly comes across a small stream. It, it runs downhill a short distance and then forks off in two directions. The branch to the left looks like to run underneath a small wooden bridge. On the right, the stream disappears into a small cave. Where should Malcolm Waters look? Under the bridge or inside the cave? Um, inside the cave. I don't know. Never done this, so... <laughs> I hardly ever play Supernatural. That's why so many people wanted me to do Ambitions, but Pink Sam and um, a couple other people that I watch videos is doing Ambitions, so I just wanted to do something different. So I decided to do Supernatural, so yes. Okay, lastly, it didn't pan out too well, but now Malcolm Waters is closer than ever. This is his last chance. It all comes down to this. Malcolm Waters has followed a path into a small clearing. There is a large hollow log in the center of the clearing. Oddly enough, a hand-painted sign pointing to the log reads fairies in here. In the very back of the clearing is a nondescript hedge. The hedge would be the perfect place to hide as you watch foolish shims fall over your log trick. If you were a fairy at the same time, fairies are so clever, it's completely possible that they expect Malcolm Water to ignore the obvious trap, and so they really are hiding inside the log. Doing their best to si siffle their tiny giggles, what will Mal Malcolm Waters do? Crawl inside the log or dive into the hedge? Let's crawl inside the log. Let's see what happens. Let me go ahead and fast forward it. Oh, what, what happened? Okay. Malcolm Waters went on an adventure to find fairies and all you could find were some seeds maybe next time Psh, that sucks um it's a ginseng seed and a lettuce seed which is perfectly fine by me because guess what we will just give it to her and give it to her okay so why is a police cruiser at our house is there a popo or a cop here or what's going on? Um, let's go ahead and have- Why are you- What the heck? What the heck? Let's go ahead and greet everybody. Um. 
invite everyone inside. That is so awkward, sitting there in your like pajamas or your underwear or whatever she was in. That's just awkward. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, practice some magic on this girl. Um, let's go ahead and do spell casting. Um, enthuse about magic. Um, actually, let's not do that. Um, we'll just go ahead and have her um, go and uh, play with magic a couple of times. There we go. That'll work. <laughs> and then as for Faye, you can go ahead and stop because someone is trying to chat with you. So. Okay, well then never mind. And then we'll go ahead and, um, can we not... I don't know. I don't know how we would raise. Hmm. I don't know how we would raise her, her magic skill or her fairy skill or whatever it is. Um. I don't know. I'm. Not, I'd never play with supernaturals, so I. I don't. I don't know. So is he home? Mm, yes, he's home. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to go ahead and end this part right here because I have this aching, aching headache. And it is like 9 something and I have to render this and get it up before I go to bed. And I want to get to bed at a decent time because of the fact that I slept in early this morning. So I'm going to be like setting like 20 freaking alarms and putting it on the other side of my room. So I actually have to wake up and get up out of bed in order to answer it. So we're just gonna go ahead and sell all their cameras. This is like easy money in the start of your game. Cause who's really gonna use those cameras? I won't. You might, but I won't. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this part and um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope you guys are looking forward to this new Let's Play. I know I'm doing, um, I'm starting up a quite a few. But that's because I'm going to be putting Noobcraft on hold and I transferred my legacy family onto my Twitch account. So if you guys want to watch that, definitely make sure you follow me on my Twitch. And there's always a link to all of my social media networks and all of that in the description below. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and end it and I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys are new to my channel... Definitely, please leave a like because it's very, very appreciated. And subscribe if you're not, if you want, if you like this video and everything. So, um, I think he's attracted to this fairy. Marigold Maldona. I think, she, I think he's attracted to her. Ooh la la, some heat is gonna start up. So, I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day. And I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Alright, bye everyone.